Hey guys, it's Bob Ferngren, and it's the beginning of a new year. And you know, I was thinking about New Year's resolutions over the last week, and I think about so many people have like a list of things that they want to accomplish. You know, they've got things on their health goals. You know, they want to work out more and eat better and drink more water. And they have things on their financial goals like getting out of debt or getting out of a dead-end job or getting promoted or investing more. They've got things on their time goals like spending more time with their family, working on their marriage. I mean, they just kind of make this whole list of things. And here's what I think. I think just like everything, uh, when we put a whole lot of things on a list, it starts to become overwhelming. So I want to talk to you about one thing today that I think can make a difference. What if you had one thing on your, on your New Year's resolutions? What if you had one thing that for sure was going to get fixed this year? Maybe it's your marriage. Maybe you need to get your marriage fixed and, and just be that awesome, awesome spouse. Maybe you need to really focus and be the best parent you can be. Maybe it's time for you to get out of debt or maybe it's time for you to get that 40 pounds off your badunkadunk. I don't know what it is, but why don't you just pick one thing? Here's what happens when you have success with one thing. It has a multiplying effect. Maybe if you focused on debt, think about it. Think about if you said, that's it. We're not going to spend more than we earn anymore. That thing's over with. We're not going to live that lifestyle, the same lifestyle that so many other people live. We're actually going to be people who live under our means and we're going to get control of our debt. Isn't that sound cool? Guess what would happen? Oh, your marriage would probably get better. Oh, you would probably start spending more time with your kids. Oh, uh, you might just feel better about yourself and start eating better and making better food choices. Or maybe it's, maybe you're just so miserable and so focused on your body being out of shape that you're not doing the things you need to do, whether it's moving your body, you know, getting to the gym or even just taking a walk or drinking more water or eating better. Guess what would happen if you got that 40 pounds off of you? you would feel some success. And that success can then transfer over to other parts of your life. I want to encourage you guys, every one of you have something that, man, fix it. Just fix it in 2016. Fix it. Focus on one thing. Focus on being great at one thing. Because you've got to have that success at one thing and it will have a multiplying effect. You'll start feeling better about yourself. And the key to all success is if you feel great about something, you're going to do more things that cause you to feel great. My prayer for you, my heart for you, is that you would have the best year ever. Hey, let's go.